buns will love me or hate me. They're, it's gonna be a love-hate relationship after you finish this workout, okay? I wanted to create a workout that you can do at home or you can do in the gym. This is also a great option if you're new to the gym and you're a little bit uncomfortable and you wanna just grab a pair of dumbbells and head to the corner and hide out there and just own that corner. I really want you to push your weight today. I want you to get a heavy dumbbell. I want you to go at it. We are trying to grow the glutes, trying to grow the quads, trying to grow those hammies. In order to do that, you need to be pushing your weight. But also, please don't hurt yourself, okay? I hope that you guys enjoy this workout. If you do, please be sure to give it a thumbs up and never forget to subscribe so you never miss a workout with weight again. Let's go grow those buns. Hun. I love that. <laughs> Also, side note, I'm wearing the Gymshark Flex leggings. They make everybody in their mother's butt look good. They will be restocked in a March. The minute that I know, you will know. I will let you know. So be sure to follow me on all my social medias, okay? Also, I post funny stuff. Okay, I think I'm funny. You may not. So just follow me anyways. Okay, let me swatch. Okay. <laughs> Alrighty guys, we are starting off with a superset. <laughs> oh, I know you're shocked. I know you're surprised. A superset is two exercises completed back to back with a little to no rest in between. We are doing 12 dumbbell sumo squats. On a sumo squat, I want your legs just past shoulder width apart and your toes pointed slightly outwards. These type of squats are gonna target more of your hamstrings and your glutes. So as you press up through the squat, I want you to focus on squeezing your hamstrings and squeezing your glutes at the top. Moving straight into 12 stiff leg deadlifts. Your feet should be shoulder width apart, so I brought them in a little bit here. And as you complete this movement, I want you to focus on keeping a straight back and hinging at the hips. As you bring that dumbbell down, keep it close to your shins, push that booty back, and as you pull up, I want you to squeeze those glutes and squeeze the hamstrings. We are doing four sets here, so after you complete both movements, take a breather, take a rest, and then we will complete the entire superset four times through. I'm using a 65 pound dumbbell and girl, I was dying. So push your weight. It's going to be challenging, but I know that you can do it. And it's all about the game. So gains train, honey, money. Okay. <laughs> Moving on to our second superset. This, my friends, is still my all-time favorite exercise for the lower half. These are Bulgarian split squats, so whether you're at home or in the gym, put your foot on a table, a chair. I'm using a bench here. I'm using two dumbbells, and I'm doing 10 reps on each leg. Every leg day is really important to focus the mind to the muscle. I repeat this in every video because it is so important. And once I started doing this, my lifts became so much more effective. So as you press up through this movement, I want you to focus on the pressure that's being built in your quads because your quads are going to feel it. And I want you to focus on pushing through those glutes. We are using a lot of hamstring and glutes and quads in this movement. Focus your mind to those muscles and you're going to feel this a lot more. After completing 10 reps of the Bulgarian split squats on each leg, we're moving on to weighted jumping lunges. Haven't done these in a hot minute. We are doing 15 of them and we are completing four sets of this super set. Moving on to a tri set, which is three exercises completed back to back with little to no rest in between. Starting off with 10 single leg RDLs. If you fall like I did, that's okay. Get back up, try it again. I lose my balance on these a lot. If you're newer and you haven't done these, hold onto a wall, a bench, a table, a chair. There should be a slight bend in that knee that you're standing on. That's gonna help target more of those hamstrings. Grab the other dumbbell and now we are doing 10 curtsy lunges on the same side that we just worked. A curtsy lunge is a reverse lunge, but instead of going straight behind you, it's gonna go to a slight diagonal. This is gonna help target the side of those glutes. Now that we've completed both of those movements on the right leg, we are now going to complete them on the left leg. 10 reps of each movement. Take your time, focus on pulling through the glutes, working those hamstrings. This is all about building that booty, you feel me? So focus on those muscles that we are building. Then I want you to drop the weight and we are going to 
finish off this tricep with jumping squats. Throwing a lot more jumping movements in, A, to burn out my muscles, and B, I'm trying to burn a little LBs, and throwing these in to keep my heart rate up helps a ton. After completing the entire tricep, take a breather about one to two minutes. We're repeating this tricep for three sets, not four, only three, okay. Finishing off with a tricep on the floor and it is all about the glutes, starting off with 10 donkey kicks. A little bit awkward and a funny movement because you wanna hold the dumbbell in the back socket of your knee. So you have to focus on keeping that leg bent and I want you to have a very slow and controlled movement. This is gonna work that bottom little peach area. Keep the dumbbell right where it is and now we are moving on to 10 fire hydrants. So instead of kicking back, we are kicking to the side, targeting that side glute. Focus on squeezing the glute through every movement. After completing 10 of the fire hydrants on the left leg, we are now going to complete 10 donkey kicks and 10 fire hydrants on the opposite leg. And to finish off this tricep, it's a little bit awkward. It's a frog hip up. Don't make eye contact with anyone, just own it. Like, you feel cool doing it, you, you'll look cool doing it, okay? Everyone's gonna be looking at you like, okay, maybe I should do that, you know? So it's just like a normal hip up, but this time your legs are gonna be out <laughs> like a little frog. See, I'm like kind of in a frog position and I'm pushing up and squeezing the glutes. I'm doing 10 reps and we are completing this tricep three times through. And then you are done. Ta-da, finito, finito. You know what I'm saying. <laughs> As always, I will write the entire workout the entire thing in the description box below so make sure to check that out after you finish watching this video okay if you haven't subscribed already do it before you leave and until next time i will see you next time i love you so much see i'm just like on it i'm just like yeah like what else fam like yeah i look weird but i'm just gonna do it you don't <laughs> okay all right that's enough i love you so much okay see ya <laughs>